Hi, and welcome to the show, Buzz, with a look at what's new at the movies. This week, look for the nightmares to return. Just when you thought it was safe to go back to sleep, slasher Freddy Krueger returns to the big screen in A Nightmare on Elm Street. On the prowl once again, the serial killer looks for a new set of victims to terrorize. Expect this remake of the 1984 original from Wes Craven to feature an even more blood-curdling Kruger than ever before. And still going strong in its second week of release is the backup plan. CBS Films' second foray into the feature film sees Jennifer Lopez return to the big screen as a woman weary of waiting for Mr. Wright, what if I'm pregnant? but desperate to become a mom in this slapstick romantic comedy. I love you. It's not the answer I was hoping for. And also out, please give. I'm not spending $200 on a pair of jeans for my teenage daughter when there are 45 homeless people living in our What does that have to do with anything? They don't want jeans. A New York mom has a dilemma. How does she stop her teenage daughter from wanting the expensive things in life, things she herself can't resist? And just how much should she jack up the prices at her high-end furniture store? Immerse yourself in the high-class problem of living well, but with a conscience. And almost out, Iron Man 2. Robert Downey Jr. returns to play the suave Tony Stark in this adrenaline-pumping sequel. Here's what he had to say at the worldwide red carpet premiere about what we can expect. He has, uh, he has nemeses that he's not aware of. He has all kinds of struggles in the lab trying to keep his motor running. So um, we figured that that would be the smartest way to kind of keep people emotionally engaged in Tony's struggle and still enjoy the ride. Fasten your seatbelts. The action starts May 7th. And that's the buzz for now. For more, stay with CBSNews.com. In New York, I'm Karina Mitchell.